Another issue for Arizona voters, Prop 206. Prop 206 proposes an increase in Arizona's minimum wage from $8.05 to $10 in 2017 and $12 by 2020. If passed on Tuesday, what effect would this increase have on the state's economy? I think it only has positive effects on the economy. We see that from uh, cities and communities and states that have passed similar laws across the country. Samuel Richards, the executive director for Protecting Arizona's Family Coalition, says Prop 206 would really help single parent families. But the policy director for Americans for Prosperity says the proposition actually harms those it intends to help. The actual facts and the economic policy is terrible for the people who are trying to get up, get advanced and move up from that minimum wage job. The increase could also affect consumers. According to an analysis by the Joint Legislative Budget Committee, some businesses may have to increase their prices or suffer the loss in profits. It will increase prices because the people who are going to have to manage the extra cost of labor are small businesses and other businesses that hire people at a minimum wage. The analysis also says the increase would directly benefit the 700,000 workers in Arizona who make less than $12 an hour. The reality is, is this is good for the economy. We'll have fewer people relying on the government for their sustainability when you can earn your living, when you can earn a living wage. About 180,000 workers in Arizona make less than $8.80 an hour. Another 250,000 make less than 10.